I've seen rumors swirl. I have not seen any facts uh, yet, and so I don't know what's going to happen. But I do know this. Uh, the Manhattan District Attorney is a Soros-funded prosecutor. And so he, like other Soros-funded prosecutors, they weaponize their office to impose a political agenda on society at the expense of the rule of law and public safety. He has downgraded over 50% of the felonies to misdemeanors. He says he doesn't want to even have jail time for the vast, vast majority of crimes. And what we've seen in Manhattan is we've seen the, sky, the, the crime rate go up and we've seen citizens become less safe. And so you're talking about this situation with, and look, I don't know what goes into paying hush money to a porn star to, to secure silence over some type of alleged affair. I just, I can't speak to that. But what I can speak to is that if you have a prosecutor who is ignoring crimes happening every single day in his jurisdiction, and he chooses to go back many, many years ago uh, to try to use something about porn star hush money payments, you know, that's an example of pursuing a political agenda and weaponizing the office. And um, I think that that's fundamentally wrong. I also think it's important to point out when you're talking about these Soros-funded prosecutors, yes, they may do a high-profile politicized prosecution, uh, and that's bad, but the real victims are ordinary New Yorkers, ordinary Americans in all these different jurisdictions, that they get victimized every day because of the reckless political agenda that these Soros DAs bring to their job. They ignore crime and they empower criminals, and that hurts people. It hurts a lot of people every single day. These Soros district attorneys are a menace to society, and I'm just glad that I'm the only governor in the country that's actually removed one from office during my tenure. And in terms of, um, our, 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 we are not involved in this, won't be involved in this. Uh, I have no interest in getting involved in some type of manufactured circus by some Soros DA, okay? He's trying to do a political spectacle. He's trying to virtue signal for his base. Uh, I've got real issues i got to deal with here in the state of Florida. We're obviously shutting down uh, CBDC, which is important. We've got so many things pending in front of the legislature. Uh, I've got to spend my time on issues that actually matter to people. Uh, I can't spend my time uh, worrying about uh, things and things of that nature. So, so we're not going to be involved in it in any way. Um, I'm fighting for Floridians and I'm fighting back against Biden. That's what I do every single day.